Laura. Laura. Say hi. Good morning guys, this is my first video ever since I cut my hair um, the, well, the first ever footage that I did, which is the one where I was cutting my hair, will come out in February So stay tuned for that Very emotional moment, if I would say But yeah, it's coming out in February, I have a very good video for that actually So I'll be using it for that video as you can see by the title, we will be doing my updated morning routine. Um, so I have basically two different morning routines. One for school and one for work. Obviously both of them is on different timing. I have to go work for 9 a.m. And I have to be in school by 8. It is currently 7.24 a.m. So I made my bed. I already set up the products I'm going to be using after I come out of the shower. But right now we're gonna do my skincare routine, my everyday skincare routine. If you guys want a specific video on that, let me know. I will be glad to make one of those for you guys. Okay. Um. See, so yeah, I'm gonna wash my face because I'm talking on camera with my crusty brush. Uh, I'm gonna show you all the products I'm gonna be using first before using them. So it's just three little products, nothing major. So first off is this cleanser from Peach and Lily. I'll be using this. I actually like it, but the fact that it's a hydrating gel cleanser, I find that it's not, let's say, harsh enough on my skin. Like I'm not feeling the cleanse feeling. I'm still, I still feel like my face is like still like greasy, oily, you know, that type of thing. So I would say this is for people with dry skin, most likely. Mine is normal to oily. All depends. Um, on the products that are that are in my hair, basically, you know, because like, yeah. Um, then I go on. Oh, then after I cleanse my face, I go on in with this moisturizer for normal to dry skin from L'Oreal Paris. It's their Hydrogenous Daily Moisturizer. Last but not least. Do not leave your house without wearing SPF, please. The reason why I started using SPF is because of my under eyes, like they were so dark. They're actually a bit lighter now, but they are so dark. They were so dark, but now they're a bit lighter. And I find that it's the sun that makes them dark. The sun rubbing my eye, or simply not getting any sleep but I'm getting sleep so that's out of the question you know so it has to be a sun or either rubbing my eye rubbing my eye is one cause as well because I be rubbing my eye at night so if you're doing that then don't do that so I started wearing SPF because of that I only use it on my face and I, sh I should be using it on my skin and my arms too you know when I work and things the work is the only reason why I'm in the sun anyway because when I'm home I'm home if I'm on the road and I don't be out in the sun so long and then when I'm at work I'm like in the sun walking up and down and when I'm at school I'm in a classroom all day the only time we go out is when we go for lunch and that's it the one I'm using is from Dior Brands it's their SPF 30 and it specifically says visage face so it's only for your face that's why it's so small it's only for your face okay while I'm cleansing my face, I'm gonna listen to Minna Pan Tarot. I'm sorry if I'm not reading it right, but still. So he just released three days ago um, a reading for Pisces for January 16th to the 22nd. So that is next week. I do have a lot of work next week and a lot of things going on with work. So I'm gonna listen to this just to get a little bit of, you know, a little feel of what next week has in stock for me. Last year, if y'all. We used to watch my old YouTube channel. Yeah, I would see. I listen to this like uh, I was into this all the time, like all the time, like every week. Literally, I was into spirituality. Literally, like 
that's when I was introduced to it. That's when I had, let's say, my awakening. And ever since I've been listening to it and I just like slacked off, literally. So I'm getting back into it. Actually. So just to, you know, be in balance with myself. And it's been helping. Really, it's been helping. When you have somebody like telling you what's coming and then all of a sudden you see it happening, it's like, okay, I know what to do with this. I know what to do with this situation. If, if you feel what, I, what I'm saying, you know, it, it doesn't influence your life. To me, it doesn't influence my life because for me, it doesn't influence my life for the simple fact that I'm just aware of some things. Like if I see it happen, then I know, you know, you listen to the reading. So this is, the, this is what's happening in front of you right now. But I won't go and look for the situation, let's say, you know, in that sense. If it, I don't know if it makes sense, but to me it makes sense, so hopefully you understand my sense. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to work just like this. Just like this. Just like this. Nah, I'm just tripping. But I thought it would have looked a little better than this. <laughs> Let me just try and fix it up. Give me a few minutes. Okay, so it's been 20 minutes. My reading is almost done. I finished my hair. I still have the mark on my forehead from the time, but small thing. Hair is done. I didn't really struggle. I'm so happy. But it is now 7.54. I'm gonna go take a bath and then we're gonna go and get ready. Okay. I actually, I low-key felt like doing makeup low-key like a little bit just probably just like wax my eyebrows mascara as usual then we're gonna do my lip once i'm done with breakfast okay yeah i did my skincare everything is done i put on some clothes real quick well my uniform pants and then a old top that i wear under my shirt what? I've been listening to this healing sound on YouTube. It's from Healing Melody. I just like to listen to it while I take a bath and stuff. It just eases my mind. Actually, it's a live video, a live stream. It's now 8 16 a.m. I'm gonna go and get something to eat real quick. I didn't get time to journal this morning, but that's okay. Like, you don't need to journal every day or whatsoever. Normally, I would be journaling and stuff, but like, it's in my morning routine, but I don't always do it, you know. The thing about a morning routine is like I try not to make it so repetitive and boring. It's like some days I let myself go and not journal. But I will do it like a morning on two. But like this morning I didn't journal. Yesterday I did journal. But like sometimes it's good to have routines and stuff. But sometimes when your body when your mind is tired, then just let it be tired. Just relax, you know? That type of stuff. So I've had a long week at work. So I'm tired, like, I'm so happy I got my hair done because I've been wearing a fro all week. So this took me a minute. 
not gonna lie but yeah let's go and grab breakfast and we're going to start to head out i need to fix my bag the lighting is so hot in the kitchen but i just made a grape jelly and wheat bread sandwich i'm gonna leave with it because i already like ate 30 a.m. and I'm making tea so the water is hot enough. I'm gonna be drinking Lipton green tea and lemon ginseng tea bag. Let's see, yeah, I'm gonna be drinking this one. And I also just fed Nora so she's all good, aren't you? Huh? You good, right? Yeah. Are you okay? When she drinks water, like all her, all the hair under her. No, just I'm just gonna wait for my tea to hot up and then I'm gonna leave with everything 